Welcome. In front of me is iPad Pro, and today I'll show you how to remove passcode through DFU mode, basically performing a reset of the device. So to get started, you will need a couple things. Number one is the cable that I use for charging, plug it into your computer. And number two is iTunes, which I have open right now. And if you're using Windows, you can always download it from Apple site and install it. And if you're using a, let's say like a MacBook Pro, you don't really need to do anything. It's already installed and you can just open it and have it ready. So what we want to do now is plug in the device with the cable to the computer. And you should see it pop up on here, which you can see it's right here and go to it. And now there's two ways to access the DFU mode. One is basically to power off the device uh, and the other one is just to do it while it's on. And both of them result in the same process really. So if your device is already powered off, you don't need to power it back on, but mine is on, so I'm gonna do it too this way. And once more, as you can see, there is a passcode. So to begin, what we wanna do is hold power key and home button. And mind you that this is for the devices that have home button still. So uh, we're gonna hold power key and home button for 10 seconds. And after 10 seconds, we're gonna let go of the power while holding still the home button. And the only difference with while well, the device is on is we won't see basically the Apple logo show up and we we'll only have the indication throughout the iTunes. So you will see that basically the screen will be constantly black and at one moment you will see on the on the iTunes that it will show us uh, recovery mode basically. So that means that we will be in DFU mode. So to get started once more, hold power and home. 10 seconds, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let go of power, keep holding home. And soon after, iTunes should switch to right there. You can let go. And now we're in DFU mode. You can just close this. And like I said, the difference if your device is off, uh, when you're holding it, it will show up in a white screen like it's turning on with the Apple logo. And then soon after it will disappear. And again, the result is basically the same. And yeah, so from here, all you need to do is just tap on restore iPad like so. Restore and update. And as you can see, there is a progress bar at the top, extracting software. And mind you, this will take like 10 minutes or so. So just be patient. And uh, yeah, so I'll be back once it's actually finished. And as you can see, it's almost finished. Okay, so once you see this, welcome to your new iPad. Uh, from here, you can either restore it from some kind of backup that, you, that was created automatically or you have created yourself. Or you can just set it up as new. I mind you that if you back up, it might also back it up with the passcode uh, that was previously set on one of those backups. I'm just gonna choose uh, set up as new and then continue and get started. And just a little bit longer and on the iPad, it should finish as well.
Yep. So from here, press home button to open. Set up manually. Can you just skip this? Continue. Nope. Don't use. I also don't want to use passcode. Don't use passcode. Don't transfer up and data. And here, once I press uh, forget Apple, basically not create it, it will start trying to connect to network. So this will take a little bit, be patient. But yeah, it will take probably like two or three minutes and it will then realize that there is no internet and we it can't connect. So I'll be able to skip this. Now, if you connect it to the network, you can, I believe, press forget password and you should have on the bottom, like barely visible option to not sign in if you don't want to actually sign in. Okay, and as you can see, finally I got the message. So no network connection, continue and don't use. Agree, agree, continue, continue, set up later, continue, 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 and get started. And as you can see, now we're back in the home screen. And if I lock the device and unlock it, you will see that there is no more passcode. So that is how you would remove a passcode through basically a hard reset. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.